What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. You saw this last video, we went to the junkyard and we got a couple things. I got my center console, I got a couple door handles, and then we also got some wheels that I have stacked up right here. I haven't had a chance to go get the tires unmounted. I need to clean them up and do all that stuff. But anyways, Brian, uh, the other Brian, he was gonna change the alternator on his hard body. He did it last night, didn't get a chance to film it. But he said it was running fine the whole time, but then he went to go get gas and then suddenly it did not want to turn over anymore. So he got the truck jumped, uh, managed to drive a couple mile, uh, more miles back home, then it stalled again. So I'm gonna go over there today, try to figure out what's going on. Hopefully you can find out what the problem is. Maybe it's a bad battery, which we kind of suspected before. But before I go over there and do that, I'm gonna do a quick change of my door handles on the Mazda real quick, since it's pretty easy to do. So let's do that first and then we'll go over there. So we got this side done now, uh, seems to be kind of solid in there, which is great. Uh, you don't know how annoying it is having to roll your window down or having to hold it from here because I'm also afraid that's going to break. Uh, so it's going to be pretty nice having now finally a door handle to pull. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and finish up the other side. So now that it's all done, actually, I just noticed too, uh, since I took the door handles out of a uh, LX with a little extra cap on it, these door handles actually have a little extra on the door handle too. That's kind of either a neat detail or maybe uh, I'm just reading too much into it, but look, it's a little bit bigger than the old one and you have a little more uh, arm room, kind of like an armrest, if anything. But we're all done here. Let's hop on the truck, we'll drive over to Brian's and see what's going on over there. We clapped out, we clapped that hard body right here. Made it to Brian's, and we're gonna figure out what's going on with this. It's a POS, man. That's what it is. <laughs> hey, it's a work in progress. That's what they call them, right? That's what Paco says. It's a work in progress. It's not a work in progress. <laughs> Brian says it's not a work in progress, so I guess we're gonna find out. What? <laughs> no cussing, no cussing, man. Man, you know, we can bleep it out. It's all, it'll be all right. I mean, it's, it's for adults. <laughs> so last time we we switched this one, and uh, honestly, that's not the best. It's not the best connection. I don't lie. So we had to flip it. We're gonna test it with the Subaru battery since his Subaru is not working either. <laughs> so we're hoping this one at least is gonna start the truck back up. So then we'll see. It does have a new alternator. He swapped it out. Look at that. Brand new down there. What I was thinking is that maybe the wires down there are the ones messing up. Started right up. Alright. You want, you want to try it again? See if it actually stays. Ah, oh, shut up. Started right up. Yeah, yeah it's still right up. And then doing that with the other one? It was struggling, right? With the other battery? Yeah, with the other one, it's like struggling. I think it's just battery though. Damn. Yeah, I know. <laughs> you, you plug everything back up, right? Yeah. What's, uh, what's that plug right there? Chilling. I don't even know where that plug came from, honestly. Dude. That shit was already loose. Mm. And that one does not go on the alternator. The alternator was a different plug that was on it. Like, what is this extra bullshit, though? I have no idea, dude. Ooh. Sensors and wires and whatnot, probably. Yeah. What? So right here, we noticed that the alternator belt was kind of loose, and it was uh, wiggling a little too much when it was on. 
So we decided we're going to take it off and take it to AutoZone and see if it was the right build for the truck. So we're going to test it out and down here. And if it's bad, then... You think it's not... So it's not turning the, the alternator? No? That's the alternator? It's not making charge? Maybe that's why it's loose, maybe? Maybe it's not enough. 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 <laughs> Are you working on the stuff right now? Yeah. <laughs> you were doing that one, yeah, that one, uh, that one video where the guy pushing the fucking top out the way, mm -hmm. and, and, and what, he, he runs away. Oh uh, yeah, he's like, who put in the Seth Rogen lap? <laughs> is it, isn't it him? No, no, it's not. dude. It's just some guy that looks like Seth Rogen. Yeah. Right? Is it in the belt bad or what? Is it this a brand new one? No, he didn't switch the belt. You didn't swap out the belt, right? No. Just you see how like you see how like these marks right here? It's like it's pulling it without a tension. Uh, yeah, without well, I don't think. Yeah, I don't think it might be wrap up either. I guess that's what I'm saying. If we go over there, we can ask, like, hey, can you give me a hard body uh, yeah. alternator belt, and then just compare it. Yeah. If it's the same size, then we know something's up. If it's not, then we can the same maybe size. get for a smaller one. Yeah. If it's not the same size, then that's part of the problem too. Skin on skin contact. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> <laughs> Calm down with that. <laughs> so filthy, Frank. How's your day going? It's all right, man. Nothing but a G thing, baby. Everybody, everybody's next to me breaking. <laughs> you see that shit? Yeah, everybody's next to me breaking. We're real Mexican going three deep. Yo, I don't know what that clacking is. <laughs> it's alright. Hey, you pretend you don't hear it, bro. It's okay. It, it'll go well, away. Usually, I have the music on, you know, so it's not that bad. <laughs> so you cover it up. I know, and like, uh, freaked out for a little bit. That's what I do. That's, uh, that's what I want to switch it to stereo. Yeah. 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 We're at McDonald's now. Why do we get excited every time he gets in the truck? Right. Can I touch your stick too, Brian? That's a lot better. Oh, hell yeah, look, look at that ugly mug out there. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, man? Yo, what up, man? Hey, you on camera? Can the camera? Can the camera? <laughs> no, nah, but we swapped the belt, and that's a hell of a lot better than this. Than this shit that came with it. Yeah, I don't know what kind of belt. They probably just had a belt laying around. I mean, and uh, huh? This other one isn't. But that one actually fits. It's actually on and not as loose as the other one was, dude. Yeah, if, if it's not loose, then, but I mean, we could always swap it out later. I mean, it probably wouldn't hurt to have all the new belts in there. Yeah. Anyways. Yeah, it'll start up, dude. Right, I got a partner. <laughs> all right, but, but that is. <laughs> it's already in there now. <laughs> that chemical warfare. Then goddamn uh, supplements I'm taking, dude. <laughs> I'm trying to get juicy for when the gym opens up. <laughs> Let's put the battery on it and uh, turn it on. Yeah, <laughs> put it on top of it like oh. it don't turn on, bro. <laughs> it don't turn on. <laughs> 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 <laugh
They gave me a bad battery. <laughs> Yeah, we need to fix that, that wire over there too, though. You got that Mexican blanket in there. Bust it out. <laughs> that belt fits a, a lot better too now. <laughs> We're gonna find out. I'm in a tree. That looks a lot better, dude, because otherwise the other barrel was like, yeah, freaking going everywhere. A lot better, a lot cleaner. So hopefully, now that he has a running, it's gonna be good. What far, bro? I, I, no, hold on. Alright, he got it. I put him over there by that little plant right here, dude. By the rest of them. Appreciate it. Nice. All right. All right. I'm going to choose. Running good. So far. We're going to find out. Got to leave Paco behind because we're not trying to. Later, Paco. <laughs> we're going to find out. He needs to come walk over there to around the block to bring the tools and shit. Look at this. <laughs> I don't got power steering. I fucking, I know, dude. I don't got power steering on mine either. But now it does it finally. Like, it's like just that first gear transition uh, as the RPM is going up, it'll stop at a certain spot. I wonder what, what that is. Well, this truck is not meant for speed anyway. This is for speed. Yeah. I mean, I haven't, I don't, I haven't talked to him. I was telling Paco, it would probably be a good idea to put it in the scan so we can know what the codes are. But you might still have that, that sensor scan, and that might be what's messing up the. Yeah. Huh? Well, let's go. Well, I got my order. Down. <laughs> You're breaking necks, bro. <laughs> Chill, bro. <laughs> Stock wheels, paint is fading. As a matter of fact, I didn't even know paint on this. But I got that bumper sound. Like, <laughs> <laughs> My radio don't even work. It only has one station. 95.7, that's it. <laughs> God damn. All right, Blitz. Let's not break it that quick, though. Let's make it back. Right. It's a, it's a farm truck now. It's a farm truck. All right. We're going to go get a scan and then see what happens, I guess. <laughs> if we can even make it there or make it back. We just got back. You got a scan. It's only a, a TPS sensor. That says it's messed up, so we don't have to worry about it. Put it later. So yeah, now he won't have to sell the clapped out <laughs> Nissan. He actually has to get it clapped out now. Yeah, I ain't got no choice now, so. <laughs> yeah. Get this black wheel center bore out and then we'll paint them. And I guess uh, find some tires, put them on. Um, he's still deciding with whether he wants to go the cheap way and slam it with like 60 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> or uh, buy the Beltec suspension kit, which is a lot nicer, but it's also like, 500, 500 bucks or something like, like that. So. I think, after tax. After tax <laughs> Plus shipping and all that stuff, so we'll figure it out. But it's running good right now, it's starting it up fine. I guess we'll find out later when he goes home or something if, he, if it's still good. <laughs> yeah, I'll probably get a phone call tonight around midnight, but hey, I'm stuck in the middle of the free <laughs> of the, the intersection or something. Yeah, but see you guys in the next one.